In Avid Media Composer, I have a top 10 list of keyboard shortcuts. The Replace Edit function ranks towards the top. Before I show you how it works, let me play through this commercial. Where does quality come from? At Novio's Bistro, it comes from our greenhouse, from our kitchen, from our kitchen to your table. At Novio's Bistro, our inspiration becomes your experience. And quality can be yours. So, as an example, perhaps I want to replace this clip segment with this one. After you load your clip into the source window, all you need to do is press the blue replace button. Now, watch the clip that I'm parked over within the timeline that I want to replace. Done! Okay, let me back up and explain this. By default, you will need to map the blue replace arrow to the keyboard settings or to the composer window to use it. As one example, navigate to the tools menu and choose command palette. Within the command palette window, under the edit tab, drag the replace edit function onto a button area at the bottom of the source side of the composer window. The blue replace function fills the segment clip area in the timeline that you are parked over based on the record tracks that are turned on. It uses the position indicators within the source window and the timeline window as a sync point. It then fills the source window content going left and right into the clip segment that you are parked over in the timeline. Done! To help avoid insufficient source material errors, make sure you have enough content to fill the area of the segment you're parked over. To help you out with this potential issue, Click on the timeline window and press the T key to mark in and out points for the clip segment that you are parked over. Then right click in the composer window and choose composer settings. Click on the edit tab and enable sync point editing and phantom marks. By marking those in and out points in the timeline, you can see the duration of the clip segment area that you need to fill based on the blue phantom marks. The blue phantom marks in the composer window will show you the duration that you need to fill within the clip segment in the timeline. Make sure you subscribe to this channel if you find these tips and tricks helpful. Also, consider becoming an Avid Media Composer Certified Specialist by visiting GeniusDB.com.